And right now, attend Dayton police raid a home just hours after a man is shot to death outside. Police arrested several men and took multiple items from the home, which officers say was a bootleg bar in the 600 block of Graymont Avenue. In our top story at 10, Robert Lowry looks into the multiple investigations now underway. Robert? Well, Mark, we've learned that the victim of that shooting is a male in his 30s. He was taken here to the Montgomery County Coroner's Office after he died at Miami Valley Hospital with several gunshot wounds. But police returned to the scene on the 600 block of Graymont Avenue only to find more illegal activity happening inside that home. Several weeks ago, we had received complaints through the neighborhood that there was an illegal liquor establishment at this address. Truckloads full of appliances hauled out of this home on the 600 block of Graymont Avenue. Dayton police say they have already had issues with this home selling alcohol illegally, but an early morning shooting brought officers right back. At the time we addressed it, closed it down. Apparently it was reopened somewhere over the Christmas holiday. Sergeant John Regal says officers noticed people moving stuff out of the home earlier in the day. Hours later, police surrounded the home, questioning suspects, even arresting two men held at the Montgomery County Jail. We removed several large industrial fryers and refrigerators from the property, along with several gaming tables, which are found inside. Police say the inside of this home acted as a bar selling food and alcohol. But the investigation into the death of a man continues as police search for the gunman. And of course, police are still searching for more information on what happened early this morning and in that shooting. If you have any information, you're asked to call the Dayton Police Department. Reporting live in Dayton, Robert Lowry, 2 News, working for you.